potential difference is the work done while bringing a unit positive charge from point A to point B right so we can write the potential difference as this VA minus VB equal to work done per unit charge right if Q amount of charge are brought from point A to point B then if the W is the work done then the potential difference will be W by Q and its unit will be volt okay what will be the unit joule per coulomb you know this the uh, work uh, or voltage volt means joules per coulomb also remember this one because it will be usable further while dealing with another uh, parameter of the current electricity okay the practical way of understanding the potential difference between two points is very interesting and is very practical thing okay in our day to day life we see this type of the source equipment right this is a lead acid battery and this is a battery which we use in our torch right and this is a simple multimeter right we uh, use multimeter to measure the potential difference right suppose if I connect this is a positive uh, probe of the multimeter if I connect this probe to the positive terminal of the battery and the negative probe to the negative terminal of the battery we here find a voltage uh, usually these battery are of 12 volt right and if we connect this terminal to the to the positive point of this battery and the negative probe is connected to the negative probe of this battery then we will find a voltage of 1.5 volt and these two voltages are DC okay this is called DC DC means direct current right so this is the potential difference across the battery that means 12 volt and 1.5 volt is the potential difference across this battery I told here DC and here in our houses we usually see in the plug point okay so in the plug point we notice three point three hole right okay like this and this one is somewhat big okay so this one is the earth point right earth terminal and this is the neutral usually it is kept at right side and this is called face right there is no plus and minus like uh, as we noticed in DC direct current cases right and if we connect the probe of a voltmeter by putting the multimeter in AC mode right so we will find approximately 220 volt and this voltage AC that means alternate current okay so this 220 volt is the potential difference across this two point right I think uh, the practical uh, way of understanding the potential difference is quite enough right sometimes uh, we also notice the potential difference across a load just like if this is a resistance and we find a IR drop that means if I is the current and R is the value of resistance then the potential difference across this resistor will be IR okay if the current is 2 ampere and resistance is 30 ohms then the PD across this resistor will be 2 into 30 that is 60 volt okay so I think uh, the understanding of the potential difference uh, is very easy and if you have any problem then ask by commenting below this video Okay. 
I think according to syllabus everything has been discussed here about the potential difference okay for 9th class and if you have any problems then comment below and if you liked the video then please subscribe okay next I will start the concept of resistance